And right now, a Tuscaloosa pastor is calling for unity. This after a Saturday night officer involved shooting. This all happened in Alberta. Three police officers are now on administrative leave. CBS 42 News reporter Tim Reed has reaction from the neighborhood where it happened. A Saturday night gun battle with police leaves bullet holes in the window and sends a man to the hospital. It happened at this house on 24th Avenue East in Alberta. They asked him to uh, raise his hands above his head and to, to get down on his knees. The individual did not do that. Um, he pulled his weapon. Officers exchanged gunfire with him. Officers were not injured. The suspect was injured. Local pastor Olivia Davis is calling on her community to get closer to God and to use faith instead of guns. We, we just need to get into a prayer mode to allow people to know if we pray, then God will answer. Davis is a family friend of the people who live in this house where the shooting took place. Today, I'm here calling him because our city needs some help. Tuscaloosa Police Chief Stephen Anderson tells us officers responded to this house Saturday night around 10 o'clock on a domestic violence call involving a man and his girlfriend. Police say at some point that 39-year-old man pulled out a gun and started firing at officers. This is always one of the most dangerous calls that we go on, domestic violence calls, because we're in somebody's house. We don't know what type of weapons they have in the house. Pastor Davis is hoping there are lessons that can be learned. And in order for them to put down their weapons and pick up the word of God, that we got to begin to show them him in us. I'm very thankful that there has been no loss of life in this. In Tuscaloosa, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.